हेलो व्यूवर्स वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल टुडे टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज ऑन साइक्लिक रिटेंडेंसी चेक दिस इज वन ऑफ द एरर डिटेक्शन मेथड इन द डेटा लिंक लेयर इन प्रीवियस सेशन आई हैव एक्सप्लेन अबाउट द सिंगल पैरिटी चेक दैट्स आल्सो एन एरर डिटेक्शन टेक्निक द डेटा लिंक लेयर दिस टेक्निक पॉपुलरली नोन एज सी आर सी इन शॉर्ट इट इज़ यूज टू चेक वेदर एनी एरर इज अकरिंग इन द डेटा ड्यूरिंग द ट्रांसमिशन नॉर्मली ए सेंडर सेंड्स द डेटा टू द रिसीवर सो during transmission the data may get corrupted now the receiver has to check whether the data received is corrected one or the corrupted one how it is going to do that is what the topic of discussion today in this session it is using a technique called as cyclic redundancy check and this technique is first okay carried out at the sender side and once the data is sent to the receiver the receiver also carry out the cyclic redundancy check technique in order to check whether the data received is error free or not so let us see what are the different steps in this technique now what i have decided is in the session or for this topic first i'll be writing what are the steps that are carried out at the sender side and one thing you have to remember here is it is based on the binary division okay and what are the steps i'll be explaining to you what i have done is first at the left side of this particular screen i have written the steps and to the right side of the screen i have written the for each of the step what is the data so let me just divide the screen so the very first thing what the sender will do is the sender has got some data to send now in this technique the sender will append n zeros how many n zeros now let me tell you how what will be the value of n in the next step but first step is what the data is there from the sender to send to the receiver then the data is getting appended with n zeros before it is sent to the receiver n is one less than the number of bits in the crc generator the crc generator and the data value will be given in the question so whatever is the crc generator in that you need to find out how many number of bits that generator has got that number of bits becomes n n minus 1 is what the number of zeros that is getting appended to the data before transmitting parallelly look at the values that i have written here data there is some data from the sender to send to the receiver let us take this as the data 11010110111 then the crc generator is 10011 now how many bits are there in the crc generator 5 bits what is that i have written here n is one less than the number of bits in the crc generator since crc generator has got 5 bits 5 minus 1 n becomes 4 now now four zeros have has to be appended to the data so till here was your actually the data that was to be sent and this four zeros now got appended to this data so we say this is the new data okay up till here hope the steps are very clear then what is that the sender has to do with this particular new data the same values whatever i have written here i have included in a form of a question a bit stream 11010110111 is transmitted using the crc method and the generator is 10011 what is the actual bit string transmitted to finally come at the actual bit string you need to follow the steps of the crc technique and uh, also remember that sometimes see here in the question the generator value itself is given 10011 suppose instead of that crc generator it crc generator polynomial will be given and if the polynomial value given is x to the power of 4 plus x plus 1 then you need to find the uh, generator value here which is becoming which is encoded as 10011 so hope you know the procedure how to encode a generator polynomial x to the power of 4 plus x plus 3 now in this particular term x to the power of 3 and x to the power of 2 is missing so, so in that place you are going to write it as 0 0 so this one indicates what x to the power of 0 starts with the highest degree here the highest degree is x to the power of 4 x to the power of 3 and x to the power of 2 you don't have anything so it will be 0 0 then comes what 1 1 you have here x in the equation so this is denoting x and you have one in the equation that is denoting this one so the, there are three terms 
x to the power of 4 x and 1 so that three terms are what denoted with ones and the missing ones are denoted with zeros so now this particular polynomial has got 5 bits so that's what we did here out of those 5 bits the procedure is u minus 1 and the resulting number that is 4 you need to append it to the data which the sender has decided to send to the data now this becomes your new data now what is the sender going to do with the new data in the crc technique this new data gets divided with the generator so let me just uh, start in this manner one 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 zero zero one one so when you multiply you will be getting okay now you need to perform the uh, subtraction here so binary subtraction is actually you are going to carry out the xor operation 0 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 and 1 0 1 so with this you can uh, here you perform the binary subtraction 0 1 is 1 1 1 is 0 0 1 0 now this 0 we will not be considering for further in the further division so now you bring down this value fine 1 0 1 1 into 1 is 1 0 1 1 1 0 0 1 1 so now perform once again the binary uh, sorry perform once again the xor here so you are getting all zeros you don't have any bits here for the division so what you will be doing is you will be bringing down all these 5 digits 5 bits are required here because the divisor has got the generator has got how many 5 bits okay so once you bring down this file you perform now how many bits you have brought down here okay so four then next is what one into one zero one sorry one zero zero one one fine now perform the binary perform the xor zero one is one 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 zero one zero zero these two you will not be carrying out then you will bring down yes so you will write here what uh, yes one more zero and then you will divide now one zero one one zero zero one one so you'll be getting what zero one is one xor zero one 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 zero one this is zero this is zero fine these two zeros will not be getting only uh, finally what is that the one last zero is remaining that you will bring down and you will write here zero in the quotient in the remainder section you got the final value as one 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 zero so this is the remainder and we call this as the crc and what the sender is going to do let me just write here this assume this as sender and the receiver so the sender whatever original data was there that original data plus crc value okay will be sent to the receiver the sender is going to send the original data and the crc value so let me take the original data now what was the original data so the original data was one one zero one zero one one zero one one and what was the crc value which we got just now from at the sender side we got one 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 zero that means these one two three four these four digits now are getting appended to the original data and then it is sent to the receiver now the receiver will take this okay and it will perform the division operation once again with the poly, with the generator value the generator value is 10011 so let us carry out the division now quickly 10011 xor operation this zero you will not be taking you will bring down this one so 
so it is completely getting divided all the bits becomes zeros here now we need to bring down five bits one zero one okay one and we require now one more one fine five bits carry out the division so you got one zero one 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 anyway these will not be included again oh, it will get divided by one so let me include the previous step i have to actually we have brought down five bits so now we will be including this after that we divided okay by one so we got one zero one one then this anyway these two will not get included so we will bring down these two now one zero one one into one becomes one zero one one fine perform the xor operation you will get all zeros you have now one more zero remaining bring down anyway it is going to become zero only so finally what is that this is the value you got here as a remainder now in crc technique see what i want to tell you is this is happening at the receiver side so whatever steps i have explained before this all the steps were carried out at the sender side and then the sender has sent sender has sent this these bits to the receiver now how did the sender form these bits these four bits were uh, is the result of the previous uh, division that was carried out at the sender side that is the remainder value and this was your original message so this crc value gets appended with the original message and it is sent to the receiver the receiver will perform the division and finally if the receiver is getting zero here as the remainder then we can conclude that no error occurred during transmission so let me write that point also if the remainder is zero if the remainder is zero at the receiver side then we can conclude that no error occurred during the transmission if you look at this question they have asked actual bits transmitted actual bit transmitted will be this one 1101011011 one, zero, one, zero, one, one, zero, one, one, and the this okay will get appended no 1100 zero, zero. so this is what is the answer for that question actual bit transmitted so now what i'll do is i'll add one more sentence in the question what what are the steps at the receiver side and is there any error occurring during transmission so now if i include this sentence in the question now you'll be carrying out this steps at the receiver side perform the division operation see what is the value for the remainder if it is zero then we can conclude that no error occurred during the transmission so this is all about the crc technique this is an error detection technique hope this session is useful to you all if you find it useful please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you bye bye and take care